I'm Tom, and for this week's quick tips I'm going to show you how to make an MK8 hopped bolt drive gear filament poly that is used in direct drive extruders. Now, these instructions work for the classic hopped bolts as well, it's just marginal differences. So I've heard people don't like watching long machining videos, so I'm just going to cut this down and tell you that there were some turning, drilling, cutting, turning, milling, drilling and tapping involved uh, to get me this stainless steel blank that has a 5mm bore, a M3 thread for the grub screw and uh, it has an outer diameter of 8 millimeters and it's 11 millimeters long so for the actual hobbing you can use a lathe, a mill, a drill press or a cordless drill but if you have a mill or a lathe available use those since those give you very fine control about how fast you're actually hobbing the blank so I had made a classic hob bolt before and uh, for that I had used a printed bearing holder which worked pretty well so I tried that again but as it turns out, these are sliding around in the vise pretty badly. So I designed an updated part, but while that was printing, I, I thought to myself, well, you have scrap metals and, and stuff sitting around, why not use that? And I did. So I made a simple holder for this gear. Now, for the actual hobby, you need to be very aware that you're actually abusing this tab. Tabs are not made to hob these stainless steel sleeves. So, the most important thing is to go slow and to use plenty of lubrication. I prefer to use M5 tabs, but M4 works almost as well. Um, M5 has the advantage that little plastic shreds fall out much easier than with M4. Once you have everything set up, start working your way in. Uh, make sure that the tab doesn't start drifting sideways. Check the depth regularly and uh, don't cut too deep because that will actually degrade the stability of the teeth. The ideal depth is around the point where the tab cuts all the way from the, from the very top of the teeth to the bottom. Yeah, so this is my finished hopped pulley filament drive gear MK8 style. Uh, I've had a couple accidents while I made it, but I think it's going to work pretty well. So, thanks for watching.